Aloha friends and welcome back to Aloha Jen's Beauty Blog. Today we are going to talk about the NUA. The NUA is an at-home radio frequency treatment device made by ND Med. ND Med makes uh, radio frequency treatment um, devices for medi spas and dermatologists. They came out with this device so you can use it in the privacy of your own home. Now, the results of this is not going to be as strong as a treatment that you would get in a medical office, but this is great to you know use so you can start working on um, tightening your skin or um, to use in between your treatments in office. So let me tell you something. Okay, so I have a list of notes here. Um, these are points that I want to make before we go into my demo because today in this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about what this device is going to do for your skin. And then you're going to go into my demo and then I'm going to show you everything that comes with the device when you pick, when you purchase it. And I'm also going to tell you about my result, my results and my final thoughts on this. Now, if you want to deep dive into the technology behind this device, my um, dear friend Katie, who is the organic esthetician, I know some of you follow her, um, she has a really good video on the NUA, and I would recommend that you check it out if you are a science geek and if you are interested in that. I don't want to deep dive like she did because she did one of the best videos that I've ever seen on this device, and I just, I know I can't top it. Okay, so after the age of 30, uh, we lose 1% of our collagen a year. And with that said, what happens to our skin, our skin becomes thinner and we start to see fine lines and wrinkles and we start to see the laxity in our skin. Our skin's a little bit loose, right? So NUA uses 3D technology. This technology delivers focused um, radio frequency energy, three layers deep into the dermis reaching an optimal temperature of 52 degrees, which triggers the skin to produce more collagen and elastin, which results in tighter skin and a reduction in wrinkles. So 12 weeks use of the NUA treatment device um, has clinically proven to generate 3.8% of new collagen and What's so awesome about this is that that's like four, like about four years worth of collagen that you're bringing back into your skin. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and let you guys go into the demo of me demonstrating the NUA, and I do bring up some key things with that in this in that demo. <laughs> Sorry, I can't talk today. Um, and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to tell you um, what comes in the box and my results and my final thoughts on. Hi everyone and welcome to the demo of the NUA RF radio frequency device. Here is my device right here. Here's what it looks like and I do have the one that plugs into the wall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug it here on the bottom in okay and then I'm going to turn it on to a level two. Now when you first get this it's recommended that you start out with level two, but if the heat feels too intense for you, you can use it on level one, but to, in order to see the best results is to turn it on to level two. So I'm going to do that, and then here is the light, and this is the button that you press for when you're ready to begin your treatment. It will start heating up the NUA. Now, the NUA does come with a lift activ activator gel, and they sell the delicate skin gel uh, separately. So this gel that comes with the NUA, I personally do not like it because it is highly fragranced, okay? And it's very, very strong. The delicate skin gel isn't fragrant, it's fragranced, but it's not, um, it's very, very lightly scented. So, and it feels better on my skin. I have no issues with this one. So we're going to go ahead and use the delicate skin gel. I have um, a little bit left in my old tube here. And if you guys could see my skin, like how much 
firmer it is like even like right here like it's a big difference see look i still have some laxicity right here but when you look at it from the side it's not as crinkly so it has tightened up a little bit and my neck and my shoulders are very very tense right now and if i released that tension this would tighten up a lot more because that's what this is mainly from um and you guys have heard me talk about that in my past videos and i do have a facial uh release um facial tension release video so what i'm doing is i'm just lining up the delicate skin gel across the electrodes here and i start out right here underneath my jawline first i spread it on with the nua and then i turn it on and what you do is you want to have it facing towards a mirror where you could see it and you just move it around in little circles until you see that light turn green on this area it takes a while for it to heat up on me i don't know if it's just because like it can't really sense my skin but i just work right underneath my jaw and there it's turning green i try to keep it away from my thyroid um like i do with pretty much all my devices so as soon as it turns green, I move it to the next spot here and I just work my way around. And with this, like I said, this is the only area where I find it takes a while for the device to heat up. And I'm not sure why that is. So each section, you treat it for four minutes. And there's six sections that you treat. Now you could go up and down like this. You can go in little circles or you can go in big circles. The bigger the circles and the faster your circles, the less heat you will feel. And you never wanna leave this on your skin in one position without moving it around because you can burn your skin with it. It gets really, really hot. So this is what I do. <clears throat> So I always start off on this section first, and then I'll show you the other sections. Sorry about that, guys. So you just keep moving it around for, for until it shuts off, which it'll vibrate. And I like to come like right up underneath here, my ear, and just work this whole entire section. So this is FDA cleared to use right underneath your jaw, your jawline and on your cheek area. Um, but it's not FDA cleared to use fully on your neck or your chest or your forehead. Um, I have been using it on my forehead and um, yeah, I've noticed that the skin has tightened up there quite a bit. And if you have a certain area where you notice that the skin is more lax, you can focus it more so on that area. Like I like to focus it right in this area since I have that laxed skin there. And I just kind of work it around. So the full treatment, if you do the six quadrants, would be 24 minutes long. I'm sorry, you guys, my gardeners are here. <laughs> so if you hear that in the background. So with this device, there's no need to follow along, really because it's pretty easy to, to use. There's no like really certain technique. It's just that you wanna keep it moving and make sure that you don't leave it in one spot. So there it um, is off now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some more gel and we're gonna work my jawline. So what I possibly might do is I might speed this the rest of this video up. I think I am. So. 
I'll, I'll speed it up slow enough to where you guys could see what I'm working, but I'm just gonna tell you this right now. Okay, so like right here is a problem area for me. Like I have, you know, a lot of laxity here. So when I'm doing this quadrant, I focus a lot more right here in this area. And then when I'm up working this quadrant, I make sure that I don't get it underneath my eye because you don't want to do that. Um, you just, just avoid that area. You can go right below your eye. I go up to here, but I focus a lot more on this side because I do have some um, sagging right there too. But okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this and we'll speed up the rest of the video. Okay guys, so here is this side. I just finished the treatment. As you can tell, I do get a little bit of pink and I'm still recovering from that rash and kind of like um, friction on the skin, massage movements. I kind of get a little bit bumpy right in this area, but it's almost gone. <laughs> so you can't really like tell too much of a difference, although it does look a lot plumper on this side. My fine lines are like really plump and stuff. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and do this side, but I give you a tip. What I like to do is, before I move over to the other side, I like to take off the gel right away. I don't really like to let it sit on my skin that long, just because it's, it's not um, the best ingredient. Um, it's, it's not clean. <laughs> but the Delicate Skin Gel is a lot cleaner than the original gel. Um, but like I said, I'm not leaving it on my skin all the time, so I do not mind. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this side and so I just finished up this side. I still have the gel on but I decided that I'm going to show you guys how I do my forehead because I've been doing it in every treatment. So I'm just going to go ahead and put some gel on here. Um, I will give you guys a, a, a tip of advice here is that um, you want to make sure that you're hydrated when you use your devices, um, you know, especially with microcurrent but I noticed a difference too with doing um, the NUA or RF is that it works better when your skin is hydrated, okay? So hydrate from the inside out. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this and spread my gel over my forehead just like this, okay? And then we're gonna turn it on and remember like what you do is you go in the circle and then when you see the light turn green, that means it's heated up to the heat it up fully and then you can move your way to the other spots and then pretty much it should be at full temperature now and you just keep working for the four minutes on your forehead so this isn't one of the areas that is listed on the manual to treat I have been treating this area and I have noticed a difference um, with my fine lines and wrinkles on my forehead. Um, I only have like one right here and one right here. Don't do what I just did and leave this on the skin. <laughs> Cause like I said, it heats up and you don't wanna like burn your skin or anything. I go in between my brows here. 
and just go sometimes i do go a little bit right here above my eyebrows like this and i noticed that it has tightened this area up so so remember that uh you know radio frequency what it does is it heats up this one uh heats up to 52 degrees i believe it is maybe maybe that's celsius and i think it's celsius i have i'll tell you guys when we close out but um this works up and it creates generates heat from the radio frequency energy and it signals your skin to produce collagen and elastin so if you notice that you're you know you have fine lines and wrinkles on your forehead maybe the skin is looking a little bit loose there then you could go ahead and take your NUA up in this area, but you know, not everybody needs to do this. I just started doing it because I wanted to test it out. And like I said, I have some fine lines up there um, that I wanted to see if it did anything and I have seen an improvement with it. So, but, I will close out with you guys and tell you all the benefits that I've seen with my skin with the NUA. Now, if you can't go in circles, you can just go up and down, just so you know. And for me personally, I like to go in circles and I don't like to use the device like this because it feels weird with the electrodes. I like to either go circles like this, small ones, or go up and down with the new one like this. It feels better on the skin. So this does get pretty warm, like I said. Um, I actually really, really like it. It's so comforting, um, especially at night, right before you go to bed. It feels really good. So, so you don't, there's no pressure that you need to put on this. It's just really light circular motions that you make. So, but you know, most of the time, like I said too, is like you won't really notice anything with your skin right away, just plumping and looking a little bit tighter. And you know, for each time you use it, it will, it'll get tighter and, and plumper, but this is something that's going to be working over a period of time, which I'll be explaining here shortly to you guys. So I'm doing this during the day because I have time. And there we go. We're done. So when you're done, what you do is you turn the device off right here. And what I like to do is I like to unplug it. And then I just generally take my wet cloth first to wipe off the gel and then I go over the electrodes with some rubbing alcohol. I let it dry and once it's dried and disinfected then I store it with the cap on it just like that. So all right guys I hope you enjoyed this demo and I will see you in a few to close out. Okay guys so I lied I'm back. Um, so this is what my skin looks like after the treatment. I washed the gel off I always wash the gel off right away, and I don't just wipe it, I wash it off because this gel I do not like to leave on my skin um, because it can have a tendency to cause me to get a rash. Well, I know the, the fragrance one does. So you wanna make sure that you thoroughly wash this gel off your skin. Do not leave it on like a mask or anything. It has no ingredients in it that are gonna benefit you to leave it on, okay? so. Yeah, overall, I'm really happy with my treatment. As you can see, I did not get that red, which is really nice. I've noticed um, that I do not get that red using the NUA, even though it heats up. My skin just seems to be really um, accepting this treatment really well. All right, guys, so I'll see you. Hey, guys, I hope you enjoyed that demo video. Um, so as you can see, the NUA is pretty easy to use. You don't really need you know, to follow along with me with this device. So first let's talk about what comes in the box with this device. So when you get the device home, this is, it's actually packaged with this cover over it and it has a sleeve, okay? So 
when you open it up, it has a plastic cover over this and you have these because it makes it easier for you to lift what's underneath. So what comes in the box is you get your new device and I have the classic and this comes with a charger. The charger is actually underneath and this is what it looks like. So this part goes into the wall and this plugs into your device. Now the cord is pretty decent. But if you're not close by a plug, it can be a, a little bit of a pain. Um, I, you know, as you heard me mention in the demo, I wish I would have gotten the cord free version of this because um, it, it would just make it easier because sometimes when I'm using it, yeah, the cord kind of gets on my nerves, but um, it would just make it easier to be, you know, go do something really quick. You're not like attached to it into the wall. So, but I, you know, was trying to save money now. The wireless version is um, $100 cheaper. I paid $199 with this, and I believe I got like a 10% discount on it. Um, so, but the the version, um, the wireless version actually um, is $100 more. It is the same technology. It works exactly the same, except for it's cord free. So what else comes in the box is the lift actor activator gel you get one full size of this now you heard me mention in the demo I don't really like this gel it's very very fragrant um and it's not the type of fragrance that I would like to smell during that whole entire time of doing the treatment also this gel irritates my skin when I use this I get really um bumps and sometimes blisters on my skin that's what happened before when I tried the Nua so I ordered the Nua like four four or five years ago from qvc.com they were carrying it and at that time they only had this gel they didn't have the delicate skin gel available and so um when I tried it my skin broke out and all these like blisters and everything it was really irritated so I had to return the Nua. Well, what made me decide to pick up the Nua again and give it another shot is that I seen that they released the Delicate Skin Gel. So I really like this one. Now I will tell you that the original gel that comes with your Nua device is not clean. It does have fragrance in it and it does have a little bit of nasties in it. This is a lot better because it doesn't have fragrance in it and um, it's, it's clean, but it's not that clean, okay? It's not something that you want to leave on your skin um, as a mask or anything like that. You want to wipe it off right away and wash your face after, okay? Because if you don't wash your face after, you could have a tendency to get broken out, especially if your skin is sensitive. But, and I know what you're going to ask me is, do you recommend that any other gel to use with the Nua. And I'm gonna tell you no. And the reason for that is because the Nua heats up. And this gel was specifically designed to work with the technology of the Nua. And if you're not using the right gel with the Nua, you could have a chance or a tendency to burn your skin and that would not be good. So I recommend the Delicate Skin Gel. So there's that. It also comes with a case that you can put your Nua in and your lifting gel and you can travel with it. You can put your gel in there. You can put your travel or your charger in it, but here is what the case looks like. It's really nice quality. It zips, it's really lovely. And what else comes in the box here is, um, you have a couple manuals. So, you have um, just, you know, some marketing stuff. You have your user manual. You have a quick start guide. You have a visual facts guide here that tells you all the areas where you can use it. And also it tells you about um, their app. Okay, so there is an app for this. I wouldn't say it's like anything like major, but I will put a video of it right here so you guys can see it, what it looks like. But you can keep track of your treatments in there and every time you log your treatment in there, you can set up a reminder to remind you of your treatments. Um, it'll tell you every time you log a treatment in there, it'll tell you how much collagen you've um, built back over the time that you've been using it. So that is really, really nice. So now this device, is not good for everybody. So one, if you have sensitive skin that's reactive 
to heat, I would not recommend this device for you. Um, if you have deeper skin tones, it is not recommended for uh, Fitzpatrick's scale of, I think it's uh, four and five, um, or any skin types that are is prone to hyperpigmentation. So if you're prone to hyperpigmentation, I would not recommend this device for you. If you have um, active acne, I would not recommend the NUA for you because you are you don't want to um, use the NUA over any open lesions or active um, pimples. Uh, also, if you have active rosacea where you um, are really sensitive, you're getting the rosacea flare-ups, I would not recommend the NUA for you. I have rosacea. I haven't had any issues with using the NUA. Um, I couldn't use it five days a week because as you guys know, um, I had I had Canandida and the rash came out on my face. So what I had to do when I first started using this is I had to use it every other day because the heat would irritate my skin. I don't think it was necessarily the heat. I think it might've been the gel. So, um, so no active rosacea, no uh, sensitive reactive skin that's um, sensitive to heat, no active acne, okay? and no skin types that is prone to hyperpigmentation. Now, there are some contraindications in, on here as well. You know, if you're pregnant and breastfeeding, you cannot use it. Um, yeah, so Fitzpatrick skin types, um, four or five, dark skin, it says. Um, uh, let's see, if you have, um, if you suffer from any autoimmune disorders like diabetes, um, you want to invite you want to stay away from this um if and that's if you have skin lesions too by the way um if you have blood clotting disorders um use blood thinning medications um are you using um accutane um within the past six months you cannot use this device um also when you're using um retin-a you do not want to use this device because it, Retin-A makes your skin really sensitive and um, this just would not be a good match for that. There's uh, more things, but those are the major ones and you could always go, sorry about that guys, we got um, interrupted. <laughs> um, so for those of you that are concerned or who are interested in this and you want want to check out the full contraindications, I recommend that you check them out on the NUA website to make sure it is right for you. Now, to use the NUA, at first, for the first 30 days, you use it three to five times a week, and I would advise you to use it more so on the five days a week. Um, you'll see you know, faster results with that. Also, being consistent with it really does matter. Um, and after that, you move to a maintenance period of using it two to three times a week. And over the period of the 12 weeks, starting from your 30 days, and then so that would be one month, okay? So you want to use it for an additional um, two months, right? So that would be three weeks, I think, or three, that would be 12 weeks, okay? And what's going to happen, what you're going to notice is that your skin's going to continually get tighter and firmer and your wrinkles will look softer, guys. Um, so I have noticed really lovely results. I am on the maintenance phase of using this now, and I love it, okay? Now, I also recommend if you're using any other at-home devices with the NUA or before the NUA, and you wanna start incorporating the NUA into your routine, for the first 30 days, I would recommend that you just use the NUA um, so you could see if it's really working because if you're not just using the NUA, what's going to happen is that you're not going to really know which one is working for you, okay? So what I recommend is, um, but if you wanted to use your other devices, you could, and I'm going to talk about that soon. What you could do is five days a week, use the NUA. So you could go maybe NUA um, microcurrent. That would be an off day. And then you could go NUA and microcurrent. Um, I would skip, uh, I wouldn't do my microcurrent, you know, two, two days in a row. I would, you know, make sure I skip a day in between or two in between. And you will see really good results with this. Um, you can also use LED light therapy after your new device, especially if your skin gets like a little bit irritated. You can go ahead and use that as well. Um, so now that I am 
finished with my 30 days um, of the treatment, I did start incorporating the Myo Lift back into my routine. So I'm using the Nuwa three days a week, two to three days a week, and the Myo Lift two days a week. And let me tell you, this is a great match, guys. I love these two devices together. Um, I got a new device that's coming. Um, it's an LED device that I'm going to be showing you guys here soon. And what I would like to know from you guys is, um, so I have some recommendations uh, for a routine with the devices, um, video like how to incorporate them into your skincare routine. Now, do you want demos of these devices or would you like for me to just do a video talking about how you can incorporate these devices into your routine? So let me know down below in the comments what you would like. Okay, so final thoughts on the Nua. If you, if your skin is looking waxed, if you're starting to see the fine lines and wrinkles, I highly recommend it. If you're within um, the limits of using this, yes, it's a great at home device. And I know a lot of you are gonna ask me, does a certain um, radio frequency devices cause volume loss in the face? The Nua does not cause volume loss. As you can see, I still have all my volume in my skin. Um, and also the Nua is actually the only radio frequency device um, for at home that is FDA cleared, by the way, so take that in mind. Um, there's a lot of radio frequency devices out there. You can buy them on Amazon. They're not all FDA, FDA cleared, and some of those can actually cause volume loss um, in your face. So if you like your cheeks, you don't want to be using those devices because they will take away from that voluminous in there. All right. So I love this device. Yes, I recommend it. I'm going to leave a link down below to where you can get it. That link actually will get you guys 10% off. It's not affiliated. Um, what they do is when a certain amount of people um, purchase from that link, I will get 10% off my next order. And um, that's just something, so you guys will get that link too when you purchase the Nua. I did purchase this on my own. They did not send it to me. I just really wanted to try it. <laughs> so yes, I think it's worth it. And um, let me know about that video on how to use your devices down below, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions on the Nua, please let me know down below in the comments. I love you and have a wonderful rest of your day. Mm -hmm. Sending you all. Hey now, take a step outside and seize the day.